Hey, what's going on? Welcome back to South 10 Beer Reviews. Back again with another review. This one is from Widowmaker out of Braintree, Massachusetts. I'm not even sure that's a real place. Yep. But uh, this is going to be Reservations at Dorcia. And we were just talking off camera. Neither of us have actually seen this movie. I've seen clips of it, mm -hmm. but I don't know. He's a yeah. business guy or something. Yeah, he's he doubles as a serial killer, I yeah. think. Yeah. Uh, Moonlight's a serial killer. Apparently Reese Witherspoon's also in this movie. We were both surprised because it came out in 2000. Yeah, I thought it was, we thought it was like 80s. Also, Reese Witherspoon, <laughs> Reese Witherspoon is in it. That's true. Anyway, uh, okay. She's in that Sweet Home Alabama movie. I don't know much about that. <laughs> You're missing uh, out. Yeah. Uh, this was canned on October 12th, so just over two months. A little over two months. Yep. Um, I don't know what this is hopped with. Uh, it is a double IPA, so 8%er. Um, let's go ahead and crack her open. See what she looks like. Have you had anything on Widowmaker? Nope. I've had a few now. They, We see some of their stuff every now and then. Pretty good, though. I like yeah. it. So I don't think I have. Did you get that one going? Pretty, pretty hazy. Yeah, it's definitely pretty hazy. Here you go, try to line it up again. Yeah. Oops, a little chunky coming out. Is it? All right, cool. Reservations at Dorcia. I like the label, though. He's pulling off, I don't know what the heck he's doing. He's pulling off his skin. Mm -hmm. Is that just like pulling off his uh, business yeah, side and have his, 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 killer, his killer side? Or is he putting this face on? It looks like it's coming off. Yeah, maybe. Either one way or the other, he's putting his serial killer face on. I mean, taking his real face <laughs> off and to, and whatever. All yep. right. Something's going on in that picture. Yeah, so hazy as Jeez, yeah. F. Uh, hazy, so hazy as AF. Yeah, I can't see it all through there. No, there's no light even coming through hardly. Nope. Like, it's um, pretty pale, pale golden. Yeah. Orange, whatever, mm -hmm. uh, like a straw. Uh, I don't know if it's a straw. straw. Quite it's, straw colored, but maybe it's a slight. Yeah, a slight tint to it. It's leaving some lacing, but yeah, I mean, it looks looks like what you'd want a, a hazy to look like. Yeah, looks like you'd want to drink it. Yeah. All right, well, let's smell it. Let's see what she smells like. Oh man. Yeah, it smells nice. Yeah. Getting big pineapple right there. Yeah, big time. I'm almost getting some. Um, berries or something like a so, mosaic type i don't know if it has mosaic in it but mosaic's known to put off that berry type aroma mm -hmm. that cat pee smell something smells like um like it's not a specific berry though it's like mm -hmm. i don't know like mixed berries or something but it's got a gosh big time pineapple though yeah i'm even getting a little like a peach or something peach or nectarine or would that be that passion fruit you're talking about possibly i don't know what this is hi uh, hopped, <laughs> hyped with i don't know what this is hopped with does it say on the can probably mm -hmm. not no, if I had to guess though, I'm gonna say at least some citra and yeah, for sure citra. Uh, something makes me think mosaic, but it doesn't have quite that. No, it's not as mosaic to me is the most it's distinguished. Very distinct, yeah, it's the most distinct hop that I yeah. can think of. And I'm not picking up on that. Maybe on the galaxy, on the maybe taste or something. Like I could see it being galaxy. It's got a little I bit. Oh, I smell it with the left nostril in it. <laughs> I'm getting that. Hold on, let me try left. the other nostril. Well, you know sinuses, right? My right gastro works way better. I think my left one does because I'm picking up on that mosaic now that you mentioned it. <laughs> but I feel like there's nothing coming through. It's got a little bit of this, um, like it's not super dank, but it's got a little bit of this like earthiness mm -hmm. to it. Yeah, I mean, it's all things good. I mean, like to me, it, 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 well, an IPA, I feel like you can get at least a hint of pine out of every single one of them. Yeah, for sure. Whether someone wants to admit it or not, yeah. I think there's at least a hint of pine. Yeah, I mean, it's... A little bit's coming through on that. Yeah. Maybe in the form of pine apple. <laughs> get it? But you would, it's got me wondering, though. Like, why is a pineapple even called a pineapple? If it has nothing to do with pine, does it? I don't think so. I should just call it a... I mean, it doesn't come from a coniferous tree. Call it a call it a palm apple. A palm apple? Don't they come from palm trees? Or no? I don't know. <laughs> well, uh, all right. <laughs> Those are coconuts. <laughs> oh, that is coconuts. <laughs> Wow, I'm an idiot. Okay, well, I'm ready to dive in. Yeah, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and try it. Cheers. Cheers. There it is. Mm-hmm. That's good stuff. Yeah, definitely pineapple coming on the taste, too. Yeah, I'd say pineapple is the most standout flavor that I'm getting. 
I think that's good. There might be some mosaic in there. I'm I'm leaning that way. If there's not, we're gonna look like idiots. Because <laughs> like you said, mosaic's pretty distinct. It is. But I'm getting that. Like it's that. almost to me, mosaic has that dirty gym locker type of dank yeah. stuff to it. Like yeah. almost BO uh, yeah. type of thing. Yeah. And I'm getting a hint of it. Yeah. There's it's definitely not, coming something coming through that's yeah. That resembles it, that's for sure. Mm-hmm. This is good, man. I like this more than Donkey Dong. Oh, for sure. Like this one. I think it might, maybe because it's more fresh. Maybe. But it's, everything's coming out. Yeah, it's very, um, I mean, it's just got a lot of hop flavor just yeah, just popping. Mm -hmm. Mouth feels spot on, too. Yeah, very, sure. uh, what's the, what's the word? Pillowy? Mm -hmm. Is that what you would use there? Yeah. It's definitely. Pillowy? Yeah. Cloudy? No. Cl no. <laughs> Cloudy. No. Clouds don't even feel like anything, I don't think. Do they? <laughs> um eight percent. I feel like it drinks pretty well. You're not picking yeah. up any alcohol. No, not not much any of it at all. Um you know, it's got enough sweetness to give it that juicy yeah. type of aspect. I'm not getting a lot of bitterness in this one at all. Mm -mm. Um they've done a good job at hiding that. Yeah, the alcohol's well hidden, the bitterness is hidden. It's just popping with citrusy and tropical hops yeah i mean yeah i mean it's everything you'd expect in a i mean when they say hazy when they say juice bomb like this is what that's a that's a pretty big juice bomb there yeah like this is what you would think if somebody said it's a juice bomb yeah like you drop that on a town that's gonna be <laughs> oh it's gonna be juicy over. it's gonna be juicy um anything uh, else like standing out i'm just just the big pineapple yeah it's real big on and pineapple. there's you think it's like more like fresh pineapple or like the um, canned like tidbits? No, fresh for like sure. Fresh pineapple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The the canned pineapple, like it just. It's almost as like a. Well, to me, it's almost like it's because surely they're adding some sort of sugar and stuff. I'm assuming. I would imagine, yeah. So it almost has a more candy. Yeah. Like I would say more. If you want to look at like canned, you know the little fruit cups, the pineapple mm -hmm. fruit cups. Yeah. I get more like that as uh, you know over. Over like canned, mm -hmm. but I mean, it tastes like very fresh pineapple to me. Yeah. Like you just cut it and took a bite out of yeah, it. Yeah, like the big, the big, like actual, like chunk or the like slices of it. Mm hmm. I like this one a lot, yeah, actually. That's, it's solid. Um, eight and a half? Is that what you said? Eight and a half? Eight, I think. Yeah, eight. eight. Yeah, yeah, you're not, I'm not picking up on that at no, all. No, it's a pretty dangerous one because you could easily put back a few of these with no problem. Oh, for sure. For sure. Well, uh, what would you rate this one? I mean, this one. It's up there. Like, I'd say uh, probably 4.7. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I like it. Yeah. I'm going to go 4. I'm just going to go 4.5. Solid 4.5. Yeah. Really, really good. Yeah. It's Definitely recommend this one. Yeah. Um, That's Widowmaker? Yep. Did you get that sent to you, or did you pick it up? I said, I picked it up, actually. Um, I've been seeing them. Just every now and then, they'll have a few of their beers around mm -hmm. uh, town. But, um. Yeah, this was reservations reservations at Dorcia. I, my lighting is a little off, like compared to normal. So you can see it a little better. All right, but anyway, yeah. So solid, solid beer. We both really like this one. Yeah, it's good. We definitely recommend picking it up. Or um, I don't know if this is a regular offering from them or seasonal. I don't know what it is. So um, if you if you know that, you can leave it in the comments if you'd mm -hmm. like. But um, anyway, we'll uh, leave you with that and uh, make sure you like this video. Leave a comment. Subscribe. Whatever you feel like doing. Do do the deal. Do the deal. Let's do this. Cheers.